What's up, Pharmacy Nation? I'm Pharmacy Joe. Thank you for being a listener of the Elective Rotation, a critical care and hospital pharmacy podcast. This is episode 455. In this episode, I'll discuss the loading dose of dexamethasone for vasogenic edema. I have all the evidence supporting today's show linked up in the show notes at pharmacyjoe.com slash episode 455. Vasogenic cerebral edema is associated with primary or metastatic brain tumors and, depending on the severity of symptoms, may present as an emergency. Dexamethasone is the corticosteroid of choice to treat vasogenic cerebral edema as its low mineral corticoid effects mean it will not promote fluid retention like other steroids might. Because the effects of dexamethasone to reduce edema are dose-dependent, the loading dose used to treat Vasogenic edema is dictated by the severity of symptoms. Severe symptoms of vasogenic edema include a focal neurologic deficit, nausea, vomiting, severe headache, and seizure. Patients with severe vasogenic edema get a 10 mg IV loading dose of dexamethasone. If vasogenic edema is suspected but symptoms are judged to be mild, a loading dose is typically not used. To get access to my free download area with 20 different resources to help hospital pharmacists, go to pharmacyjoe.com free. Thank you so much for listening. I'll see you in the next episode of the Elective Rotation.